Trump's election presents an unprecedented legal situation. He is scheduled to be sentenced in New York criminal court later this month on his conviction of 34 felony counts of falsifying business records. Trump also faces other criminal charges brought by special counsel Jack Smith in his ongoing federal election subversion case. The president-elect has argued he was being unjustly targeted and vowed to seek retribution. Here in the WRL Live Center, still keeping an eye on how world leaders are reacting to uh, uh, Donald Trump's uh, uh, president-elect status this morning. And I saw this a post from the president of South Korea congratulating Trump, saying, under your strong leadership, the future of the Republic of Korea, U.S. alliance, and America will shine brighter. And this got me thinking just a bit about the things that Trump will have to contend with once he returns to the White House, especially because North Korea is now has an involvement in the Russia-Ukraine war. But the other elements here, the U.S. economy, obviously, a big reason a lot of people went out to the polls, the Israel-Hamas war, and the Israel-Hezbollah conflict. We'll be watching the feeds to see other reaction from world leaders here on the WRL Live Center.